MCP stands for Model Context Protocol. And what it provides is the ability to basically attach additional tooling to each of these applications. Some of these tools maybe look up additional information or perform other actions, send emails, look up Slack messages, look up details in a Salesforce database. It could be lots of different things. But there's a problem how these MCP servers are configured. For example, if we look at this configuration, this is for Claude Desktop, we'll see that in order to run this MCP server, I have to have NPX installed. Many of you may not know what NPX is. That's a package manager and tool that comes in as part of the Node ecosystem. A lot of other MCP servers may use UVX coming from the Python ecosystem or a variety of other tools. So again, I had to have this installed. What version does it need? Lots of other questions that come up here. Do I trust this package? I don't know where some random server is coming from here. Is it the authoritative source for a particular set of tools that I want to use? Again, do I trust this? What other access is this going to have to my host file system and, and more? Is it trustworthy? And then finally, I've also got a credential that's being configured here. I don't want my credentials just sitting in static files. This doesn't feel very safe to me. And this is just Claude's configuration. I may have similar things for cursor or for VS Code or any other AI tool that I'm wanting to use. So the first thing that Docker announced was the MCP catalog. What this does is, is it provides a collection of containerized MCP servers. So I don't have to worry about the runtime and ins installation configuration 